Oh, I go straight to the deep end. Oh, I think the scoreline, obviously. Um, you know, start the game. Thought we really started with a good purpose. Uh, to go in front six nil. Uh, we turned over too much possession. Compounded by a couple of seven tackle kicks and one out in the full. Sort of put us under the pressure, but to um, to still lead with a couple of minutes to go before half time. I really thought the effort and the desperation was there, and that caught us at the back end of the game in the second half. So. Um, Look, I feel that there was parts of the game that can be really proud of and there's parts of the game that need to be better. I thought the first 10 minutes of the second half where we, we were um, parked on their line for that 10 minutes, we really didn't play any football that we practised. Um, so we need to be really better at, at that part of the, part of the field. Um, you know, to the Cowboys' credit, uh, you know, field position-wise, they, they really dominated that in the second half. We're coming out of the corner a fair bit. Um, we had some tired men because the amount of work we'd done and, and that desperation we showed early in the game. Some new players in key positions will it take a while to get the combinations going this year. Yeah, yeah, we, we, we expected that. Uh, certainly, uh, when you've got a change to your spine, uh, you know, and and then we move Tyson out of that edge into that middle, that's going to take a little bit of time, but that's not an excuse. Um, you know, like if we... We go in at half time with 50 50 possession. We're fresh in the second half. We play a little bit smarter to start the second half. Different game, you know. Uh, even if young Laurie scores, uh, it was a pretty good try save there off that tap. You get a bit of momentum from that, but uh, it wasn't a B, mate. The cows probably handled the, well, they did. They definitely handled the, the weather and the humidity better. How much did you miss Debellum? Could he have, sorry, could he have helped uh, stop Tamalolo? Yeah, well, we all want to stop him. Um, you know, Jack, you know, you, you don't replace Jack, but you just got to go on, get on with it, and that's what we're doing. Was that a distraction during the week? Not at all. No, Jack was never in our plans to play this week. The preparation going into tonight's match, was that at all affected when you guys were warming up and that sort of thing? No, 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 the preparation was affected at all. Um, you know, obviously to start the year to play up here is a, a different beast than we've had before. Um, you know, with the with the, obviously the weather, humidity and, and the rain that come down, but both teams playing it. It's just that they, they, um, they managed it better than we did. Uh, so, give credit where it's due. They, I think they were over 80% completions and their kicking game was, was fair. Yeah. Your, uh, wait, correct me if it's pronounced wrong, but Rabalawa? Um, your winger. Yep. I'll be quite impressed with his performance tonight. Yeah, strong carry, which we expected, and, and um, defended well. Yeah, he's look. He's he's only three years into his rugby league career, so he's got a, a big future ahead, and we're pretty excited that he's uh, he's with us, and you'll see improvement each week with him. Had to watch uh, Nene score against you guys. Yeah, we don't like seeing good players leave the organisation. He was a good player with us too. Um, you know, to score that try in the corner, not many get that across. Uh, but he did do it, and you know, it was a difficult conversation when he left. Uh, he wanted to go home to, and spend more time with his family, and, and I respected that. But uh, you know, he certainly showed at different times what he can do. You guys got a short turnaround now. What's the focus uh, to get ready for the Rabbitohs? Yeah, we've got a five-day turn into a Thursday night, so um, you know, it's all about recovery this week and and get some get some really good information between the years about what we need to improve. But as I said, I thought that if we show that effort and that desperation and really control possession, you'll see a different football team on Thursday night. The Rabbitohs look pretty hot on Friday night, so it's not going to get any easier next week? No, well, no game's easy. Uh, you know, they're a team that's, that's uh, certainly... Um, we're close to it last year, weren't they? Um, you know, they got beaten with, in the qualifier and started the year pretty strong against the Roosters, which were the Premiers last year. So, yeah, it's certainly a task, but nothing that we uh, we can't manage and look forward to. Thanks, guys. Cheers, boys. Thanks,